The X Interview, hosted by Global X from the Skoll World Forum. When one starts a social entrepreneurial venture, I think the height of um, misunderstanding is to think one knows exactly where one is going. Um, it's really important to realize that the key metaphor here, or the key saying, is what Napoleon said when he said, on s'engage et puis on voit. One becomes engaged, then one sees what the possibilities are. And that's the way these kinds of ventures open up. Uh, you can't know the steps that you're going to be able to take, you're going to have to take later on, nor do you have enough knowledge at this point when you start out. So to be open to the fact that in the beginning you really don't know, and usually in the middle you don't know either, and that you're going to create it from what came before, not from your preconceived ideas. And what, what I would add, building on that, is the need for each of us as we go in the world to, to make it a better place, which is essentially what we're all trying to do, is that we do so with congruence, with integrity, that we come from um, a place of compassion, that we understand that we're doing this work for, for to, to heal divisions, not to create more of them. And so that truth about ourselves, finding that, for each of us it is different, for each of us to find that core of our purpose here, what's our truth, and to live that, to live that in our lives, to live that in our work, to bring it to others. People do not respect us for agreeing with them. They respect us for being true to ourselves. And so that is, for me, one of the key things for all of us to strive for. Well, we happen to love working as a couple. There are people who say you shouldn't do it or it can't be done, but that's not our position. Uh, frankly, we like the idea that we have this absolutely, uh, we share a vision, we have something we can talk about incessantly. Um, we are able to do work that complements what the other person is doing. Uh, we have attitudes um, that we don't exist. We're, you know, we're obviously not the same people, but we're able to combine the characteristics of two people, which makes us a much more powerful individual and couple. Mm. You know, there's, there's something about um, a, a shared vision and a shared love going together. Somebody once said to me that there's a new form of relationship that is emerging in the world. And, and you do see um, a number of couples who choose to work together. And of course there are, are, are pitfalls to it. And I do think, again, it's a, it's a choice. For some people it would never work. Um, but I don't think that there's any principle against it. It's just a matter of, is this right for us? Does this work for us? And, and for us, it was when we first met each other, is, it was that sense of, of the love that we felt for each other, of course, was just the overwhelming, and we had the shared vision. And we found that we had discovered some of the same things. That, so, for instance, when, when we met, we, uh, John um, said to me uh, in, in an early conversation, he said I, that he, in his life he had decided he, he wanted to um, work uh, to, build, uh, to build a new world, not to fight an old one. I had come to that decision myself, but I had never met another human being who had found that and who was able to articulate that and say, this is how I'm living my life. I was totally amazed that the two of us had found this ourselves in our lives. And that, so, that's not quite accurate in the sense of what she said was, I had stolen her notebooks and had gotten the idea from her, and that because she couldn't conceive that anybody would have this same kind of idea. I'm joking, of but, course. But you always say this, but it's not true. <laughs> <laughs> Global X is also on Social Edge at socialedge.org.